When you lay down to sleep true, think about the self indeed. Think about yourself so true and have a dream revealing who you be. Think of yourself, yes indeed, and think of all that you have done. Imagine yourself now inside your dream. When you lay down to sleep true, imagine yourself meeting you, interacting with yourself, behaving as you always do. What would your first response to yourself be? What would you do true? When you meet yourself inside a dream, what would come of it true? As though you were the other person in your life so true. Now remember and then start to daydream and imagine yourself true. There you stand before you there, acting as you always do. Not as you imagined yourself to and true. Not as though the image of that self you contain of yourself true. But as you are in truth, indeed, indeed, in truth, in all the choices that you make so true. Imagine now that you have a problem with yourself, indeed, so true, indeed. How do you handle this problem? Oh, how do you handle conflict with others, true, indeed? Now you go about your day inside this dreamy world. Imagining yourself right there like a conscience whispering, whispering in your ear true. There before you acting upon you in true you feel the reaction to each deed. Cause that is you and that is you and you is there before you true indeed. Like a daydream or a dream as you do sleep imagine yourself there. Imagine yourself before you as you are truly there. Imagine yourself interacting, behaving with you and there and here and there and there and here. There you lie before yourself, doing what you do with all, with all your might and truth. There you lie before yourself, being who you be in truth. Just as you are in life indeed, just as though you are in life, there you stand before yourself. Imagine it and close your eyes and open as you close your eyes. Imagine it there, imagine it. There you sit before yourself, telling all, acting as you act in through and through and through your life indeed. Close your eyes, imagine there, yourself true indeed. Imagine you standing there all the times of your life, every deed and every choice as you do your daily deeds. There you stand, there you stand, there you stand, reacting to your deeds and choice and true. Imagine yourself when you close your eyes in true. Imagine yourself outside of you like a reflection of your life. Every deed and every choice coming back at you. Close your eyes, imagine it. There you stand in the days and there you stand before you true. There you stand behaving true and doing the deeds you do that you have done throughout your life. Every deed and every choice, everything you've done so true. Think of all those good deeds you've done, feel them done to you. Think of all those ungood deeds, all those ungood deeds done to Imagine yourself when you close your eyes, imagine yourself there before you true. Imagine it like walking in a dream.
Let your let it remain when you open your eyes. There you stand, interacting with yourself. Just you there, no one else. Just yourself. Just you there, and then you behave as you behave. And what is the reaction from yourself? When you do behave with this or that, like this or that, or this or that, what do you do there? What behavior when you close your eyes? When you react with another person, there you stand, just indeed another version of you there, next to them, reacting to the same deeds that you've done to them indeed. Reacting just as you would react, so now you're reacting with the others in this world and yourself in an image of yourself reflected back like a dream at you indeed. Feel the touch and feel the turn, feel the twist and feel the word, hear the voice of yourself indeed. See yourself there lying next to everyone you interact with in your dance of life. See it there and watch them approach and watch them be just as you would be if you were reacting to yourself. Reacting just as you would do when you do the deeds you do. Only now is the reaction that you have when you do with others true. Imagine yourself in front of the others, in front of the others true. There you stand, this indeed, now what will you treat those others like? Knowing that you're going to see yourself, imagine it true, see yourself. As that other there before, you true, true, ever so true, ever so truly there indeed, acting as you would react in life. Imagine them coming forth indeed a moment after you have done, acted with that other in the dance of life. Reacting to what you did do to that other in this world. Reacting to that in truth indeed. Imagine yourself now reacting to and coming forth and moving towards you or touching you and attacking you if you attack them true. Defending as you would defend yourself. Defending them as you defend themselves in that other image of you true. Another image of you true standing next to you. Standing there before you there when you react with others true. Reacting the way you'd react with them reacting back at you. How would you handle it? If you did these deeds to them, the deeds you did to them now, now, feel them done to you the way you would react to them being done to you. As though you were reacting to the deeds that were done to you. When you act upon another, yes indeed any other true. There you stand, an image of yourself in your mind, coming back and treating you in the way you treat that situation true. There you stand, before you true. Whenever you react with and dance with another, whenever you are interacting with another in this world, there you stand a version of yourself who acts and behaves just as you, reacts as you would react to you, reacts to what you do indeed to the others in this world. 
react to you, to what you do, to anyone or anything in this world indeed, coming back at you, treats you like you treat you true, as you would treat yourself indeed. Cause how would you treat yourself in true? Like you treat any other in this world indeed. So how would you react indeed? If someone came up to you true? And treated you with harm? What would you do to defend yourself? Feel that defense rise up in two. You and the other, you indeed. What if you were attacking in harm? Then you would have to defend from yourself as well as the other true. But what if you do approach in kind? Then what is your reaction true? To kindness given to you, that other self, what does it do? How does it behave towards you? An altered version of yourself, but the same as you, and the same indeed in choice, indeed in true. There you stand, another version, when you close your eyes. When you open them, there it stands inside your conscience true. How will you treat others now that you know that you will be treated the same? By yourself, by that image of that self, there appearing up before you when you close your eyes. When you lay to sleep at night, Think of all the deeds of the day. Think of all the deeds of the life. And think of yourself there standing true before you there. Dancing with you, interacting with you, choosing to be with you true. How will you treat yourself indeed? The same way that you've treated others in this world. Is how that other image treats you true. So what are you? Who are you? That other image, just an image of you. Upon you true. What do you feel like to other people? Tell me true. Something to imagine true. What conscience I give to you. Thank you for your time. Christopher David Clayton, true.